The news agency in Russia reported that the Kinzhal hypersonic missile will be integrated into Russia's sophisticated Su-57 stealth fighter. In accordance with the Russian state armament program for 2018-2027, Su-57 fighter jets will be equipped with hypersonic missiles. Jet fighter will receive missiles with characteristics similar to Kinzhal missiles but with smaller interbody and size placements, said the person in the Russian defense industry as quoted from the page The National Interest. The prospect of using the hypersonic missile on the Su-57 was previously touched upon by the general director of the Tactical Missiles Corporation, KTRV, Boris Obnasov. In perspective, we can certainly anticipate this weaponry, hypersonic, over the next decade. Everything will arrive in time for the Su-57, possibly including hypersonic weapons, he said. The KH-47M2 Kinzhal is a nuclear-capable hypersonic missile launched by Russian President Vladimir Putin in his high-profile speech in early 2018. A missile that flies at hypersonic speed, 10 times faster than the speed of sound, can also maneuver on all phases of its flight trajectory, which also allows it to overcome all existing anti-aircraft and anti-missile defense systems, and provide conventional and nuclear warheads in the distances more than 2,000 kilometers, Putin said at the time. Previous speculations about this topic centered around the difficulty of installing Kinzhal missiles to the Su-57, and did so without reducing the ability of the stealth, sophisticated jet. The Russian Ministry of Defense has yet to issue an official confirmation. This raises a number of questions regarding the main developments projected by the Russian threat. Does the characteristic similar to the Kinzhal missile mean the smaller KH-47M2 variant, or a different hypersonic missile with capabilities similar to Kinzhal missiles? Will smaller dimensions be translated into a reduced range or other technical limitations compared to the original Kinzhal, and how many of these missiles can be stored in the Su-57 weapon space? Will this Kinzhal missile increase the Su-57 cross-section? This development can be taken as a sign of the Kremlin's confidence in the state of the Su-57 project, which relies heavily on the progress of the production of the new Saturn Isdali 30 Su-57 engine. There is no indication whether the smaller Kinzhal variant will be compatible with other Russian fighter jets that do not match the original KH-47M2. Not surprisingly, the Russian Air Force will look for ways to package the capabilities of its latest missiles along with its latest jet technology. The integration of Russia from hypersonic missiles with the capability of the fifth-generation stealth aircraft can generate substantial dividends in the threat-projected capacity. However, it remains to be seen how much this weapon will increase the production costs of the already expensive Su-57 to the extent that there is a solution to reduce the hidden impact of hypersonic missiles. Will it increase the cost of a more expensive Su-57? Kinzhal was first demonstrated with the MiG-31K supersonic fighter, an iteration of the MiG-31 designed for new hypersonic missiles. In the same vein, the 222M3 fighter was modified from the tuple of 222M to carry four Kinzhal missiles. While the two aircraft were modified to accommodate the KH-47M2 Kinzhal, it is noteworthy that the KH-47M2 was reportedly being modified to accommodate the Su-57.